A great portfolio is essential for every designer. It's the one thing that either attracts or repels clients. However, building one can often be super time consuming. Not only that, but picking the right fonts, the right colors, and the right layouts can also make it stressful. And at the end of the day, a great portfolio should simply shine the light on your work. And that's exactly why I've picked out five free framer templates you can get right now and use as your portfolio. Let's get started. First, we have smooth template. And as you can see, this template really shines with its details. It has this little pixelated animation at the bottom. And then if we refresh it, you also see the slight entrance animation that we have. The hero section is fairly simple, but it does have these little details that make it super interesting. As we start scrolling, we see the portfolio section. If we click on one of the projects, you're gonna see this page transition, which is also super nice. If you go back to the homepage and we start scrolling, you will see that you have also space for a testimonial, again, to build social proof. And here you can talk a bit about yourself, the skills you have. Here you can share your experience and your stack. And finally, again, we see uh, the footer. So this is the smooth template again, super nice, super clean. It's also super simple. It won't take you a lot to customize it and get it up and running. But with that out of the way, let's move to the next template, which is called web stack. And as you can see, this template has an amazing entrance animation. The hero text is super interesting with these little elements. And then we have the CTA button, which is very eye catching with this neon green color. And as we start scrolling, you will see the portfolio section, which again, super clean, people can click view all projects to obviously see the whole projects page if we click on one of these projects this is the page that we'll see we have some information on the left side with the visit website button that's sticky and then on the right you can actually use this to present the project um, that you want to present okay so if we go back to the home page and start scrolling uh, you will see that you also are able to show your tech stack and show your proficiency in each one with these little percentage bars below that we have a process section and this is great if you're trying to attract freelance clients and kind of give an overview of your process we have some numbers here which again boost the social proof some testimonials this is a great testimonial section that can again boost your social proof the faq then we have social media links and finally the footer this template also has a projects index page where people can scroll through all of your projects and an about and contact page which obviously is an about and contact page you can share some more info about you and then people can get in touch by filling out this form okay so that's the web stack template next up we have vitrine and this is probably one of my favorite templates because of how minimalistic it is it's actually a single page template of course with pages for each project and this is used by one of my friends eric uh, if you're watching this shout out i found out about this template through you but why i love this template is because as you can see it's super clean and it really does a great job at shining light on your work. It's great for graphic designers, for web designers, and any sort of design work that relies on visually representing um, you know, the projects. Uh, so uh, this is the first section you see, all of the projects. Then we have an about section, services, experience, awards, and finally in the footer you have a contact section. So again, super simplistic. You can set this up in just a few hours and have it ready, and you know it will do everything you need a portfolio website to do. Next up, we have the index template. Now, this is a bit of a different approach to a portfolio template because we have a sidebar instead of a navigation, but it works super well. As you can see, it also has tons of small details that make this project come to life. As we scroll down, you will see the featured work section, which is technically the portfolio. And again, once you click it, you see how fast that transition was. And again, you have space for some text and images. We also have a newsletter subscription. And then this is the footer. You can obviously customize it. But if we go back to the home page, you will see that under portfolio, we have a section that you can use to talk a bit more about yourself, share your work experience. And also this section will allow you to showcase some spotlights of your year or of your career overall. And finally, we have a bookmark section, but if you don't have a need for it, you can simply hide it. And then also we have, uh, you know, the projects page. We have the services page if you want to share the pricing for your services. And finally, the contact where people can fill out a form and get in touch with you or get your email, phone number or social media and get in touch with you that way. 
So that pretty much covers index folio. It's great for people that want a, a bit of a different approach to their portfolio. So next up we have Hanzo. Now Hanzo's design is very, very, very nice. I mean the font, the little details, the shadow that we have here is super nice. And if we start scrolling and we uh, go to one of the project pages, you can again see that we have big images here small tags like the services you delivered what you used and the timeline and then we just focus on the work that you have if we go back and we start scrolling a bit more we have a section um, that you can just use to kind of introduce yourself you can also share some client logos that you've worked with it's just a super super clean template you can also move around these services um, tiles which is you know it's just a fun thing uh, then you can share your experience right here and finally I really love the footer it's very minimalistic we don't have a lot of elements but basically the layout and the details here make it really nice for example this little light ray in the background with the noise texture on top is super super clean this template is also a single page template so you can set it up you know super quick and have your uh, new portfolio website ready and this pretty much concludes what I have for you guys today if you want to see more portfolio templates agency templates templates and just a wide range of web design related stuff then you can subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.